Hi, I would like to share with you a bit of scriptures from 1 Timothy um, chapter 2, uh, starting start with verse 1. I exhort, therefore, that first of all, supplications, prayers, intercessions, and giving of thanks may be made for all men, for kings and for all that are in authority, that we may lead a quiet and peaceable life in all godliness and honesty. For this is good and acceptable in the sight of God our Savior, who will have all men to be saved and, and to come unto the knowledge of the truth. For is, there is one God, one mediator between God and men, the man, Christ Jesus, who gave himself a ransom for all to be, to be testified in due time. Wherefore I am ordained a preacher and an apostle, I speak the truth in Christ and lie not, a teacher of the Gentiles in faith and verity. Okay, those scriptures right there are talk, talking about um, that we need to pray for um, our leaders, um, especially um, ones that are, ones are um, like, who are like uh, authoritarians and um, dictators and stuff like that. And just, uh, I mean, I, I, th I think the pe people in, in China right now who, um, who are Christians, I mean, Th those pe those people are um, basically suffering persecution uh, in the hand, hand of um, authoritarian government. Where I got, I mean, just uh, and yet, and yet, even during your persecution, I I believe you're still praying for your leaders that they come to know come to know Jesus Christ, and um, and and that's and that's what we should pray pray that um, for, for for I mean. For leaders, and especially for Donald Trump, because uh, I I think he re really needs a uh, revelation of Jesus Christ in his life. I mean, I mean, God has saved saved him for 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 this mo moment. I mean, he, he, but um, he he's only got is only only as many days to live as God God would give him, and um, he and we need to he needs to redeem time. That he's given, especially, I mean, especially now that he's elected to um, a position of power once again, just uh, and and we we need to pray that um he he ta he takes this um position seriously and that um he he would um enact enact the um role of pre president of the United States um. With, I mean, what, what, I mean that he would um that 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 he would um come, come against all, all um all the certain th post people in the United States um and not not just for not just for um people people that he's concerned about but for all people I mean just uh, I mean. And he needs to look out for all, all who call themselves Christians. I mean, even if they don't don't fully agree, agree with him or or with Christian nationalists on anything, just uh, I mean, which com which comes down to um, what what I really want to talk talk about. Um, can America truly be saved? I mean, after after um, it's a after he's elected um, Donald Trump, I mean, again as president of the United States, I mean, I mean, this is it's like is it people, people in their America are basically come, come and get be so cold-hearted and just uh, that their only concern concerns about themselves and not about other people, especially people. People um, of color, of people of people who are um, who, who have um, disabilities, or um, people people who and just uh, I mean people who just who just don't don't look like or think like or act like them, or just um, I mean can America can America truly be saved? I, I think I think it can, but it's going to have to come down to, um, the, the, I mean, citizens that did not vote for Trump, um, humbling themselves before God. I mean, I mean, and becoming Christians and basically opposing um, Donald Trump and his, uh, his 
and his, his um, plans and policies for for Americans and just stuff. Uh, we, I mean, we need we need to have um, pe pe people who who will stand stand strong in faith and get against Donald Trump and then just uh, hold him account accountable for all all things that he he's going to do and his second term as president and just uh and and we um yeah it do it doesn't mean that it doesn't mean mean that we should um we we should go go uh, all all out to war with him i mean we're i mean G i mean G jesus said i mean hey jesus has given us the um the sort of spirit, which is the word truth. I mean, and where to where to use that? I mean, uh, as their sword to attack. I mean, to attack um, false doctrine, or arguments, and every high thing that exalts itself against the knowledge of God. Um, and we're um, what el What else is there? And this. Uh, yeah, we 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 who are, um, who did not vote for Donald Trump need need to come together. Uh, I mean, un, un, in the spirit of Jesus Christ. I mean that. Um, I mean, cause, I mean, we need we need to pray for our enemies, especially those who set themselves up as as our enemies. And I just saw uh, that. Um, that we come to know Jesus, Jesus Christ as Lord, as Lord and Savior. I mean, I mean, these these people are basically lost as lost can be. I mean, they're they're so de devoted to to their idolatry of Donald Trump and just like um, and and they're also so, so broken and hurt and bitter and just uh, I mean. We're not we're not to be broken and bitter on like they 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 are. I mean, who who whoever has got Jesus Christ um, in their hearts basically have basically has the hope of glory in them, as Paul said in in one of his letters um, that that if you have that if you have Christ in you, he's 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 all that that you really need, and uh, and and don't don't need to seek seek um, any anyone else. Um, I mean, cause, cause everyone everyone else is go, going to steer steer you away from um, Jesus Christ, and especially especially um, Donald Trump. I mean, I mean, but we still need we still need to pr pray for. Um, People like Donald Trump, because uh, I mean, he, I mean, he, were, he, were, I mean, he, he's so broken and bitter. I mean, and just, uh, I mean, I mean, it doesn't look, it doesn't look like he, he, he's going to um, be the uh, best president that that the United States has ever had. He says he's got. Got, got, going to be the worst president. And, I mean, if he hasn't already proven that for for his first term, and I mean, I mean, we do people want him to be a great president? I'm sure there, I'm sure there are pe people who are in in that camp who say who want him to be the pre best president, but on. Um, that's going that that's going to take prayer. That's going to take devotion. That's going that that's going to take um, Christians that are devoted to, that are devoted their lives to love, loving their neighbor as they love themselves. I mean, because if I mean, if people truly love themselves, um, I, I, I mean, care, care, caring for. Caring for themselves and nourishing themselves, I'm sure they're, they'll pretty much love love their neighbor. I mean, I mean, and if they and if they love God, I'm sure they'll lo love their brother and sister. 
and that's pretty much all I'm going to share with you in this uh, video. So, have a good day, and may God bless you.